Besides being an introvert, you might also have found yourself being very careful about your actions so you can end up making good choices. This is a good thing to do, but at some point, you found yourself thinking so much about a matter until it hurts you or you become obsessive about it. You should pay attention to whether you overthink things because doing so will often naturally hold you back from doing so much. Overthinking could kill your productivity. It is a good thing to think things through before you make a decision, but sometimes you can spend so much time overthinking you never make a move in the direction of what you know you should do. According to psychologist Dr. Sanam Hafiz, overthinking holds us back when paralysis by analysis sets in. This causes people to remain stuck at jobs, in unfulfilling relationships, and in negative loops of sabotage and self-talk. Overthinking is disconnection from your inner voice. Your inner voice tells you to take that dream job 100 miles away, but your fear leads to overthinking all the reasons why it won't work out. You should weigh your options and check to be sure you're making the right decision. However, you don't want to overthink things until your goal is halted. If you're not sure you're an overthinker, this video will show you certain signs you should watch out for just to confirm your overthinking or not and how that might be hurting you. 1. Something is on your mind and you go over it continuously. When a particular idea comes to your mind and you find you cannot stop thinking about it until it becomes overwhelming, you are overthinking. You consider the circumstances, events and different things that could happen. Then you have all kinds of thoughts running through your head. Sadly, also, you go over each of these thoughts, you're an overthinker. 2. You have problems making decisions. You can't seem to conclude the steps to take. You can't make up your mind about a career path to follow or some food to eat at a restaurant. Sometimes, making this decision could take months or even a year or more. You're overthinking things. Experts suggest you pick something and make corrections along the way where need be. 3. You remember every single word and detail from a conversation. When someone says something that hurts you or encourages you, you find yourself thinking again and again about it. You try to read meanings to what has been said or what someone did to you. You want to let things go, but you find yourself obsessing over what has been said or done to you. That makes you nervous and gives you a sense of being under pressure all the time. 4. You ignore your instincts. Your gods may be telling you to take a particular direction. Somehow, you know this is the direction to take. But you overanalyze things, running through again and again in your mind, until eventually, as it always happens, you never take a step in that direction. One psychologist acknowledges that if you tend to ignore your gut instincts and make long pros and cons list, it's likely you're overthinking it. Consider the several sides of the matter, but don't be afraid to let your gods kick in. Listening to your intuition is truly important because the intuition is a surprisingly accurate tool. Research published in the journal, Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, found that when participants of the study were forced to choose between two options based on instinct alone, they made the right call up to 90% of the time. 5. You see the world in black and white. You don't accept moderate views. Things are either good or bad. They are either right or wrong. As a result, when you love a person, you love them deeply. Also, when you hate someone, you hate them deeply. This is just how you see things. 6. You constantly ruminate. If you catch yourself always spending a lot of time going over and over the same thing in your head about things that have happened in the past, it is a clear sign that you are an overthinker. As an overthinker, you catch yourself remembering situations or conversations that happened some time ago and you're thinking deeply about it. This can be tiring because you're throwing away emotional energy just dwelling on the matter. It can leave you feeling physically and emotionally drained. 7. You take others' opinions too seriously. Do you catch yourself analyzing every word someone says to you and you're trying to understand exactly what the other person wants to tell you? You're an overthinker. It can be most difficult if you're empathetic and sensitive. Whatever the other person says or do can affect you deeply or emotionally. Overthinking in this way can make a person do crazy things. People who overthink always want to analyze details of issues that happen to or around them. 8. You avoid making choices. According to psychologist Marnie Amsalan, PhD, when it seems more comfortable to avoid conversations with others or actually finding answers instead of replaying things in your head, this reinforces overthinking and can lead to you talking yourself out of something. Besides avoiding conflicts, you should learn to confront your conflict and to deal with it. 9. You crave love but seldom receive it. As an overthinker, you're delicate and pure. As a result, 
When the love you want has not reciprocated, you feel down, and you can shut yourself off from the world because you need time to heal your wounded heart. 10. You miss deadlines. When you give yourself deadlines and you find you miss the deadlines too many times, you're likely overthinking. You're deferring although you've given yourself a deadline. If this video inspired you, like the video. We love you.